Greetings, friends. I'm actually vlogging while the sun is out. Been a little bit more productive today, just a little. I got an email back from one of the places I applied to, the children's place. So at least I got it. They're going to tell me, um, hopefully within the next week or so, if they're interested. But I'm just going to have to wait around and hopefully some more of these places pop up. I might even look into um, Blockbuster and a couple of the places that I have on my list of places I need to apply. And I was just told by Dominic that I should try looking into Spencer's. I totally didn't even think about that. I thought about Hot Topic, but not Spencer's, so I'll take a look. Apparently someone doesn't like me because I keep getting thumbs down. Go down, there's another one here. There's another one. I think it's the same person, too. Which is fine. I mean, everyone's free to their opinion, but I I'm kind of curious, who's thumbing me down? And um, just as a heads up, as I always say, if there's something you guys don't like about my videos or any way you want me to improve them, the content that I post, if you guys think that I'm too negative, I'm too positive, um, go ahead and give me your feedback. Obviously, I'm not going to cater to every single demand. I'm going to keep this realistic as possible. I'm not going to act. I'm just going to be myself. But if there are certain things that I vlog that aren't really necessary and I agree with you, I am more than happy to make a few adjustments just to make sure that you guys are just as happy with the vlog experience as I am. So feel free to let me know what your opinion is. I, I, I definitely appreciate any feedback that I get. I am actually really happy right now. I just checked the mail. I didn't check it for two days. And my DVDs had showed up. I let my brother borrow my Star Wars Blu-ray set and I've wanted to do a marathon because I've never done it before. Now I have my set and I can finally do it. Sweet. Quick errand. I ran to the post office real quick. Chris was originally going to take me, but he got super wrapped up in some video stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and head home. And yeah, I think my friend Christine might be stopped by a little bit. She's dropped off some of my things and I'm going to her. And then I got to find her own job. So I'm going to keep myself busy. Alright, I'm at McDonald's. This is the place I haven't been for a while, but they've changed their menu slightly since I've been here. And they actually have burgers with lettuce on them. It used to be Big Mac was the only thing with lettuce on it. Now they're actually expanding upon that to try to compete. And I, straight away from the dollar menu, I actually got something a little bit more expensive this time around just to try to see if it's worth it or not. This is power cord. Wow. Okay, check this out. McDonald's is doing this now, and I have to be quite honest, this is the first McDonald's I've seen this with, and that's kind of weird. It's a coax. Well, I guess this is where our TV used to be. That's why these power things are here. But people are using them for their computers and stuff. So Misty May and Carrie Wash are playing China right now. This is legitimately a really good match, but it also has me a little worried because China is doing really well starting out, and I'm hoping they start to fail now. I'm sorry for being mean to China, but I really don't want them to win. Well. Ever since the iPhone and just smartphones in general have been around, I've been noticing a lot more professional sports commentators with their phones going off during broadcast. This is like at least the fifth time in the last year I've heard one of the iPhone text message ringtones go off, so I'm surprised I haven't made a rule about that yet. My head actually really hurts right now. I have a pretty bad headache, so I'm going to go ahead and call tonight early. So thanks for watching. I will see you tomorrow.